We're live at Threat Stadium here in New York, New York, the home of the Tyrants, who would like to remind you that the game will begin after the mandatory half an hour clapping is over. The first one to stop clapping will be killed. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Malice Hellboys take on the New York Tyrants. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Are you ready for some MFL action? Am I? I love MILFs! Mutants I'd like to fuck! He said MFL, not M-I-L-F, you have wit. Oh! I thought you were talking about the Mayhem Bowl halftime MILF lingerie girls team! What a zombie QB with that big rack of ribs and almost no waist at all! Ho ho! Va 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 boom! With the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grip. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> Second down and five. Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to fight it. And it's first and ten. here and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. <laughs> They're back up here on first and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. He could go all the way. The 20. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's why he's on defense, schmuck. Second down and ten. The defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirty Trick. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. Yeah. 
They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. Man, he just laid the wood on him on that one and knocked the ball out. And it's first and ten. Running like a moose. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. First down. He was. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. We can have it. And it's first and ten. And he gets three yards on that run. Second down and seven. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Air ball! Hey, did we start letting ghosts into the NFL grim? No, nah, that was just a shitty pass to absolutely no one. A nice run for five yards. Third down and five. see a lot of carnage today folks these teams have bad blood between them apparently they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck raccoon rabi blood is my thought always a player's favorite and it's first and ten They've used a strawberry field's dirty trick. <laughs> Those guys don't know which way forward is now. <laughs> Second down in a very lot. game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong-il. He's supercharged and can electrocute any of... Oh, and the defender cut off that pass like a suburban... ...way to speak to the manager. And he sure got his refund. Man, what a hit that was. Oh, holy mo... 
Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Briggs? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they're not the guy. They called a warp speed dirty trick. He's so fast he wants to... Ah, uh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. Second down and more than the QB would like. is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. Third down and, well, good luck. That ball was almost intercepted. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. Oh, no good. Now that punt, the return man cut. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And it's first and ten. Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot! That's why we love the MFL! And it's first and ten. First and ten. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. That's a little on the... Oh, man, he really... And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos bearing. I thought the only tie we'd see would be a noose. Instead, they're in a dead heat. Tie game at the end of one. Second down to nine. Just got crushed. <laughs> and it's first and ten. With that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. And it's first and ten. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. Was totally uncalled for, and that's why we love the MFL. And it's
It's first and ten. Second down and a lot. And that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap. And he held on to that one for a first down. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off right now. has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! First and eight to go. Quarterback passes for a touchdown! Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. <laughs> he did not see that coming, partner. Yeah, not a ground crew's gonna come out and pick him up. This guy really kills the momentum. The kicker just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. And it's first and ten. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Third down and six. was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. First and ten. And he breaks away. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. Oh, hold everything. Looks like there's a penalty on the play. First and ten. <laughs> Second down and long. Deflection. Third down and long. Great play by the defense. 
It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feeling. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. Straight through the uprights. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. I call that the honeymoon offense. And I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Third and two. how you run the football for, with the vicious kill did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25 i didn't know that yeah right below attending bachelor parties and owning a sam schlong galaxy phone and it's first and ten and that takes us to the two minute warning And it's first and ten. Boom! Dead and down! He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said! Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. First down and nine. if you want to cut away during this ritualistic dance. Uh, Grim? The, uh, the crowd started chanting. Why, uh, yes, uh, <laughs> yes, they did. We're, we're going to go ahead and lock the announcer's booth until he's done dancing. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. And like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Smart move.
move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. And it's first and ten. Oh, great play. He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Bricks. Very smart. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. Oh, with the brain scramp. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Huh. Sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they're not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? And he just wrestles away from that. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was... Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the... See it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and... And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blasphemy. And that's another turnover for the defense. <laughs> Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. Uh, that's a good point, Grim. <laughs> and the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Bricks' match stooping time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. Uh, come on, man. You got to catch that. I don't catch anything, Grim. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, throw in the half. Can you pick me up with soil and beer? The teams come out of halftime all tied up and ready to battle it out. Oh, geez, Grim, I hope someone ties them soon. They gotta play football. Oh, shit. <laughs> Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and, uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. You can't keep a good mutant down. And he's able to grab that one somehow. Oh, uh, come on. That was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. Ooh. 
And it's first and ten. And another interception. This quarterback is going to... One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the line. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. At this rate, the QB's going to have more interceptions than completions. And he's off to the races. And it's first and ten. And the defense calls a Strawberry Fields dirty trick. You know, this takes me back to those crazy days of my youth, Bricks. <laughs> Good times. Married a little Swedish midget, lived in a sweat lodge for about a year. Well, at least the, I think that's what I did. Second down in a lot. And they're picking up chunks of yards now. Nice reception for 10 yards. And that'll bring up third and one. Burners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. <laughs> and it's first and ten. First and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. A man from prison just came out of the field. It's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is. And it's first and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little leaving a wake of destruction in his path. He is fighting for the 30. He's in the 20. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Oh, mama. Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. And he finds open spaces running. 
driving toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. The 20. He's at the 10. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First and eight to go. No, well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a That's the ball, asshole. And that'll be second and eight to go. Great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Third down and eight. And the ball hits the field incomplete. He threw it when no one could catch it. Some things like that in the quarterback. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty nukes on the defensive line. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah! Boom, and he's dead! Oh, bingo! Bingo! The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. Well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. This guy's a brick shit out. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. First down and three. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. <laughs> and
And it's first and ten. And he just... And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy Division and weep. Oh, and it looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. First down and long. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. They just went zebra hunting, and it looks like they got their trophy. <laughs> First down and forever. to the air and came up big. Second down and six. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. He broke free and has open field in front of him. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. The 10. And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. And here comes the extra point attempt. right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to talk like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. To the moon! Another loser bites the dust. In the MFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. Oh, so close, but not today. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. holds that pass play to only two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to... It's just like the 4th of July, only with blood and guts. 
The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. First down to five. Hot, hot one, hot two. Oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. <laughs> Second down and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hot. You've got to catch that. Third down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot, hot, hot. And he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. Yeah, it's all those Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. Ah. Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in midair. It is a fumble indeed. Fumble Manji, the new game from Wilton Crabtree. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. Second down in a very lot. Hot one, hot two. Deflected the ball. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Prince's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Wow, he took like a thousand volts of shock there. They did that to my Aunt Lizzie because she thought she was the reincarnation of Lizzie Borden and the ex -mimer. Did the shock treatment work? Well, after she killed four of the doctors and zapped her, they never bothered her again. So, yeah, I, I guess it worked for her. 
The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Ah, we are, Grim. Ah, we are. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can see that. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. The offense is down to their last two receivers. Once they're gone, it's game over, baby. Ah, those poor receivers. They're really getting the snot kicked on them. Someone ought to just shoot them, put them out of their misery. Uh, don't worry, that's coming. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. The defender says, I don't think so. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense... And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his... The NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I got to check it off my death mutant bingo card. I only need one more. The New York Tyrants were eviscerated today and leave a wake of blood and tendons in this forfeit loss. It's probably a good thing the game ended up in forfeit. They weren't going to make it out of the stadium alive with this performance anyway. The fans were going to kill them if the opposition didn't. Gotta love that fan passion. Let's hear what the game's MVP has to say about this carnage. I'd rather listen to Sarah Palin read the entire works of Shakespeare while tripping my brains out. Uh, actually, that sounds kind of fun. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.